Okay, this tutorial covers Java uh, FX properties with uh, progress bar and progress indicator. Just create a new project. Uh, I'm going to copy package into um, FXML documents. Let me remove label. Then I will add progress bar. For button, I will change to plus symbol. FX ID, I will say BTM plus. And then uh, on action, button handle plus button action. Progress bar, PB quantity. Okay, that's all. Okay, make controller, remove uh, label. Okay, handle button action methods. I no longer use it, so let me remove. Let me create a new file called item. I'm going to add only one called um, quantity. This time I'm going to use um, double properties because progress bar, progress indicator use double value. Again, by convention, setters, getters, we add final. And then I will say this quantity, referring to its own object, and then final. That's all for item class. Let me create an item object. Then um, initialize a quantity property of item object. Then I'm going to add listener using a change listener class, sorry, change listener interface. Super reports to uh, object super class. Then implementation. Open curry blankets and close. We need to import change listener interface and then implement abstract class belongs to change listener interface. We will focus on progress bar quantity.
progress pro properties. Then let me bind with the uh, items um, quantity property. So then when we change the value in quantity of item object, it will be uh, reflected to progress bar. This is what we call it as a unidirectional um, binding. Now we are going to set uh, quantity plus 0.1 that equals to uh, 10 percent because the progress bar has a value between 0 to 1 which is 0 to 100 percent. So when we click we are going to increase by uh, 10 percent. Sorry, 40, 50, 60, 100 percent. Okay, let's add um, progress indicator. In this case, it will be clear than uh, progress bar. We are going to also add another button controlling uh, minus value minus here um, I will name it as um, BTM minus name it as uh, handle minus button action so each time when you click minus button it will reduce by 10% PI quantity. That's all. Save. Make new controller. Implementation is pretty same, so let me copy. Paste the next line. FX ID is PI quantity. Implementation instead of plus, we are going to use minus 0 0.1. That's all. Increase by 10 percent and decrease by 10 percent. If you look at here, again we have uh, Aramos in a class. You can replace with uh, lambda expression. So copy paste it. Then let me make it as a comment, just in case we may lose it. Use lambda expressions almost identical here at the end of line number 39 we are using lambda expression you can guess that it will work exactly the same suppose uh, progress bar progress indicator yeah we are using JavaFX properties belongs to item class. That's all. Thank you.